We're in Grantham mega, mega early for Andy's birthday treat of a dentist appointment. So we're letting him have a birthday treat right up and down in a lift before we head over there. It's also raining outside. And because of the rain and other inclement conditions, I'm wearing big boy trousers for the first time in about a month and I don't care for it. Also, because it's like half nine in the morning and we've been up for two hours now to get us here, I'm regretting staying up until three watching the wrestling last night. But I wouldn't have been able to sleep anyway because I was absolutely buzzing after an awesome comeback stream, which if you were part of the stream, thank you, you're awesome. Um, if you want to see what the streams are like, you need to head over to twitch.tv slash FM tonight, 9 p.m. But that's yesterday now. See, that's how tired I am. I'll be back on Thursday for you lot. It's the people from... Get I can't get my head around this. I need coffee. Don't disappoint, it was a roaring success. Um, we had him building up over the last, is it three or four trips now, where the first time he didn't want to open his mouth at all. The dentist is brilliant. We rave about him every time we go there. Um, she is the best professional involved in Andy's care. Um, but she built him up to five seconds of looking in his mouth, up to 10 seconds. This time, he's been built up to 20 seconds. Um, he didn't, she didn't even need it. That We counted to about 15 and she was done. His teeth are fine. He'd got a sticker. We were in there about a minute. It's all good. And now, He's just sort of wandering around, he's over there somewhere, doing his usual tour of the church while I nurse my really, really, really painful knee. I mentioned yesterday that I was worried I might have re-injured the ligament that I tore two years ago. And it's got all the same symptoms. I think I need to, I think I need to make an appointment for the doctors. It hurts to sit down. When I bend it, it's clicking and cracking. I'm really limping, it really hurts. I was supposed to run this morning, but I've postponed it until tomorrow. If I have to postpone it again tomorrow, then we start to have a problem because that means I've effectively missed a session. And once I miss a session, it's not a habit anymore. And psychologically, it's harder to keep to. So I need to kind of figure out how to make it all feel better today so that I can definitely go out and run on it tomorrow. But I don't want to push it too hard because tomorrow night, I've got the match day announcing thing at Posh kind of need to be able to walk for that. Well for the first time ever I was stood with my camera in my bag because it's been raining on and off and someone's just come up to me and said hang on a minute you're Lelujo. Yes I am um, and we had a quick chat and he went away again. That never stops being equal parts weird and awesome. Hello to person I just met outside the church in Grantham. It's now been 45 minutes since we arrived at the church. You've had three lots of bells in that time. <laughs> and you seem to be trying to film yourself. <laughs> You're trying to film yourself filming yourself. That's it, 11 o'clock. What is it? 11 o'clock. Goodness me, that was a lot of bells. Madness. It's now time for the ultimate birthday treat. He's going in his second lift of the day. Any third. two lift, third? Yeah. But it was the same one twice. Oh, no, the car park. Oh, car park, of course. A three lift day is a good day in anyone's measure, presumably. Don't close the lights up. Like that. No, 
we're finished now. That's it. Well, it wouldn't have been a birthday without a trip to McDonald's. Is that good? Yeah. Splendid. Now we head home so I can get on with some work. Should be full on party day. Apologies that you're so low down. Um, I usually put you on a table, but there's Lego construction going on over there. Oh, no. um, it's supposed to be Andy's birthday present, but Andy's not even in the room. But Anna is just making Lego. What's that, Minecraft? I helped. These two are making, they're making Minecraft Lego. But the reason we've uh, got you out is because we're finally gonna tr try the American Easy Cheese that was set, I had two different cans of this sent to me. Um, come on, come and sit down, because you're having some of this. Um, we've had two different cans sent to me by different people as birthday presents. Thank you very much, it's much appreciated. I've never ever had cheese in a can before. Have you ever had cheese in a can before? Don't think so. Don't think so, good. So we don't know what we're expecting. Did I just break that? No, because I'm supposed to pull it off to pull, pull it. Yeah, it's fine. Is that... Yeah, how, it's so how do you get the cheese out? You squeeze. Hold on. No, wait. I don't know how to do it. I don't understand. For best, best results, remove cap, hold applicator tip close to food, press tip firmly. So you're supposed to like... Right, grab, grab me a piece of bread. Also available in cheddar flavour. What flavour is this? American cheese. What's the difference between American cheese and cheddar? I don't know. Also available in cheddar flavour, cheddar and bacon oh, flavour, and really? sharp cheddar flavour. I want cheddar. So we need to press the tip firmly and move slowly across the food surface. So, like this. Is that what it... I don't know what it means. Right? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's a lot of cheese. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that coming out. That's a lot of cheese. Oh my. <laughs> it looks horrible. Cheese in a can. Um, we'll spread it a little bit. <laughs> Don't worry, you can have half of this. Okay. Well, lots of people like... Oh, the cheese doesn't spread. It just kind of moves around. Mm. Well, those people just spray it into their mouths. It doesn't spread. Okay, it's spread a little bit. How do you, how do you work Right, this? you, to work it, you just kind of push it down like that. But push it sideways? Yeah. It's literally coming back up. Right, there you go, have your piece. Do you want to spread it or just have it like that? I'm going to spread it because I don't want chunks of cheese. So, this has got Easy Cheese American, um, which apparently I have been contacted by two separate genuine Americans saying this stuff isn't available in America. <laughs> this is an English food. That's made to look American, oh, but it's easy to spread. They've got it on a hot dog on there. That's interesting. Cheese on a hot dog sounds pretty cool. Um, do you do not put cheese on your hot dogs? No, because I'm normal. You don't you, put cheese on hot yes, dogs. I do. Either. I've never seen. Yeah. That. I put the the square one thingy in the jig. You know what I mean? Mm. So let's. Um, oh, you're eating it like quickly. It reminds me of burger cheese, like the squares. Yeah, it just tastes like the squares of cheese that you have on barbecue food. But in squirty form. It's weird. It's an excellent source of calcium. You know what I really want to do? I really want to squirt it straight into my mouth, I don't know why. Go for it in a minute. <laughs> like all good cheeses, there's no need to refrigerate. Yes. And it's a new formula, still made with real cheese. But real cheese that you don't have to refrigerate, which is worrying. Um, Doesn't that mean it's like mouldy cheese? Open wide. <gasps> I'm scared now. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's all over her face. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's your verdict on cheese uh, face? Horrible. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's fine. It'll be all right on a burger. I don't know how long it lasts for now it's open, oh. but you do have another can. What we'll do is we'll do some burgers soon and we'll have the bacon jam on one part and the squirty cheese on the other and I'll give you a proper verdict on it then. Uh, come and show the camera, don't just show me. <laughs> come and sit back down. She's cleaned her glasses. I have not, I just wiped it, the yeah. big screen off. I still want to eat I'm going to go and give it to Dave.
can't help but notice there's somebody missing. Just <laughs> put it on the table with it. That's really well, We have got a cake ready for him. <laughs> Andrew Campbell! But it seems he's not in the room. Come on, blow them out! <laughs> George is singing anyway. He's looking at me. Happy birthday to you! Now, because no one got me a cake on my birthday, I think it's only fair that I blow them out. No! You're 13. Turn them around, then that's the right age for me. <laughs> <laughs> Andy, are you coming? Oh, he's coming up, sorry. Are you coming to blow them out? No. Just blow them out, that's all you need to do. I don't think he wants to be part of the birthday experience. You can't blow them out. I didn't get to blow out any on my birthday because no one got me a cake. You are 35 years old. Uh, 31, clearly, from uh, the cake. No, you are. Well, this is a cake evidence suggests otherwise. He's actually 27, guys. I'm going to buy a cake. Ow! And put 37 candles on feet. Here he is. What have we got here? Yeah, blow this. <sighs> well done! Yay! Finish! Thank you. Do you want the face? You want a lot of things, perhaps you should get a job. You don't have a job. <laughs> However, I have the face. <laughs> that concludes his birthday. He's now upstairs having a bath, getting ready for bed. Um, I can't tell you the tie, because I have nasty rash all around my wrist. On my left hand, so I have to wear my watch. On my right wrist, like a lunatic. Um, but I assume it's about 8 o'clock, so I'm going to try and get this edited before I stream tonight so that I don't end up staying up until 3am watching wrestling because if I end up editing after the stream, I know full well I'm going to end up watching Raw and I could really do with an early night, like a perform. I don't want to be on proper YouTuber time just yet. I'd quite like to try and remain a normal adult for a little bit longer. So, that was his birthday. Thank you very much for watching and thank you very much for all the birthday wishes we got throughout the day. That was very cool.